The Touch and See project is a unique collaboration between the School of Engineering at Lancaster University, Lancaster City Museums and Galloway's a Sight Loss Charity. And the aim of the project is to increase the accessibility of historic 2D artefacts, principally for people with sight loss and visual impairment. So the team here at Lancaster University developed the product uh, with the help of uh, feedback from um, focus groups from people with varying degrees of um, sight impairment about their experience of museums and art galleries. So we use the, the latest technology including uh, additive manufacturing or 3D printing uh, to create a, a novel product which was an adjustable uh, backlit haptic stand with audio output um, capable of holding lithophanes. Now lithophane is a, a, a 3D reproduction of a 2D image uh, and it provides the user with a, a tactile means by which to engage the images um, such as paintings or uh, watercolours. Every museum has 2D images, works of art, paintings and we really struggle with making those accessible to people with sight loss, people who, who can't see them properly and so this project to us is, is a bit of a holy grail really because we're hoping to make this, these images accessible to people with sight loss and, and other people as well and to do that in a way that is as cheap as possible so that hopefully pretty much every museum in the country can have you know, some, of, some of these lithophanes uh, so that people with, as I say, with sight loss can actually access exhibitions um, which they haven't been able to to before. It's been absolutely incredible to see the development and the, the sharing of experience by our community to, to build um, an accessible product which is going to help um, many visually impaired people um, access um, art in a different way that is accessible to them. But incredibly, it's something that um, has being developed by visually impaired people, for visually impaired people. The product is making art accessible and, and inclusive. Um, and it's fantastic to, to bring the experience together um, of, the, of the Lancaster Museum and Lancaster University. It, it's quite user friendly, I think is the, the correct word. It will be useful for quite a range uh, of, of people as well. Uh, and of course, not forgetting the younger uh, people who have uh, sight disabilities. Um, I think it was, it was good for all generations. I think it will help, yeah. As I say, it's not just like audio description where they go in and say there's somebody still on the left and somebody still on the right, whatever. I think it'll be a, a good thing for everybody. I think people who haven't got sight loss can sort of use it and say, you know, maybe even close their eyes and use it and say, you know, I sort of get an understanding of how people with sight loss would look at it as well. I've tried the lithophanes for myself and the audio description and it's just, it's fantastic to see it and I, and I really do hope uh, that we can build on this and that we can encourage uh, more um, organisations and museums, exhibitions to, to, to really think about how they can make their their art and their products accessible to those with a visual impairment.